Did I think I was gonna have to do this again? Yeah, because there's a lot of douchebags and there's only one of me. This is my first video of the new year. I wanted to come in with a bang. For your guys' entertainment, I like to um, I like to poke the bear a little bit. I like to stir the pot. I forgot I already did a video where I called cheaters and I was like, I kind of want to do that again. Cause like, why not just like start the year off just exposing all the assholes of the world and like starting off the year fresh after that. I asked you guys on my Instagram for numbers and names of people who have either cheated on you or currently cheating on you. Make sure to go follow my Instagram and Twitter if you want to be included in future videos or send me numbers for future prank call videos, that'd be greatly appreciated, thank you. I was expecting maybe like 50 numbers. There can't be this many people that are being cheated on. Like, is it really this common? Oh, it is. I asked you guys and I got... <laughs> That's even worse than last time, but I, I can believe it. We're gonna be calling up these horrible men and women who have cheated on their girlfriends, boyfriends. Some of these are full grown men who've cheated on their wife. Is this a good idea? Probably not, no, but do I wanna do it anyways? Yes, I do. I remember last time when I called cheaters and a man told me that he was cheating on his girlfriend with a boy. Maybe we can get more confessions out of these men. This time I wanna try and get them to admit it. Like, let's be true to ourselves. If you're a piece of shit, let's just fucking own it. Be who you are. Before we start this, everyone Everyone, let's take a deep breath together. Let's. This person writes, actually, I was wondering if you could prank my very faithful boyfriend into thinking someone caught him cheating. His name is Caleb. Maybe try and make him believe it's someone close to us. Tell him we go to school together. Okay, let's um put some heat on Caleb. Hello. Hi, I was just calling to ask, why did you cheat on Kristen? What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. Someone very close to you let me know. Someone at the middle and is tied. No clue what you're talking about. Caleb, come on. Like, let's let's drop the facade. You know what I'm talking about. Uh-huh. And it would be a shame if someone let Kristen know. Go ahead, let her know whatever you gotta know. <laughs> find out. Caleb, this is a prank call that wasn't real. You didn't cheat on Kristen. She knows you're, in quotes, a very faithful boyfriend. He took that like a champ. He didn't stutter once. He said, bitch, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, you twink. Why did I, like, channel Gossip Girl for a second? I was like, good morning, followers. It'd be a shame if Kay got wind of C cheating on her at That was a lot. Your call has been forwarded oh, to I thought an he picked up. Voice. No, you're gonna answer. Your call has been forwarded. God fucking damn it. Let's try Jared. Jared sounds like a real douche canoe. There's no context, so I'm just going into this blindly. Hello? Hello? Is this Jared? Yes. Hi, I was just wondering, why did you cheat in your last relationship? Huh? Why did you cheat in your last relationship? You heard me. I didn't. Hey, who are you? You don't need to know, Jared. Okay, I didn't cheat, so whatever. I think you did. When was my last relationship then? Mm -hmm. A couple years ago. Yeah, yeah. Okay. What's that relationship for? So how did I, buddy? Why are you interrogating me? You're the liar. I'm not liar. I don't even know who you are. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know who you are. I don't even know who you are. Okay, dogs can hear you. Grant, calm the hell down. We can all hear you. Yeah, dogs can hear you. And, oh, fucker. I should call them back, but I'm scared. Yeah. Hey, Devin, I was just wondering why you cheated on Dev with three different girls. Holy, oh, you sound like an adult. I am. She, uh, I tried going back to her, and she's the one who's leaving me. Yeah, I would too. I never cheated on her. I think you did. I didn't. Well, you did. I literally have text messages of her just randomly sending me uh, it's called Apple Pay request. I mean, pay her the money. <laughs> I didn't cheat on her. No matter what, you're not going to believe me. Yeah, I'm not going to believe you because you know what? I don't believe any man anywhere. Um, I know Devin is like right next to you. No, nah, she's not. I'm hired through a special service. Consider me like a hitman, but I'm not anyone and it's for cheaters. I always tried being with her. She's the one who rejected me multiple times. <laughs> Even when we were together, she was the one talking to the other guys. get the wrong. Are you gaslighting me, Devin? I mean, oh, she said that too. She said I do that. Hello? Hey, Opal. Um, I was just wondering, why did you cheat on Ethan? Who is this? You don't need to know. I'm asking you. Why did you cheat on Ethan? Literally, Ethan is none of your business. Goodbye now. No, it actually is my business. Birthstone. Excuse 
excuse me <laughs> who was the guy or girl okay so literally cassidy is none of ethan's business because it's not his life anymore it's mine damn you just name dropped cassidy so who the fuck is cassidy i w i didn't bring up cassidy you did you just forget about cassidy we don't need to talk about her no i think now that you just opened up that can of worms i think we do actually need to talk about cassidy who's cassidy yeah. look cassidy <sighs> Ethan got cheated on because he wasn't being good enough, okay? He wasn't... <laughs> Did know, you just admit like, to it, Opal? Don't blame me. Like I know I am blaming he you. He wasn't enough, so he had to go. That's why Cassidy was there for me. Um, how long were you and Ethan together before you cheated on him? Um, like, I think a year. It wasn't even that long. A, a year is a long time, Birthstone. Why do you keep calling me Birthstone? I get it. My name's a Birthstone, but like... It's, it's funny as fuck. Anyway, you cheated after a year of being together? Like I said, he wasn't fulfilling needs, so he had to be done with. Well, why didn't you just break up with him? Because I would understand if you broke up with him, then went to Cassidy. Because, like... You were too scared, huh? You're a coward, Birthstone. <laughs> and how did Ethan find out about it? Because one of my friends said something. Good, that's a good friend. Are you still friends with that person? No, I got her. <sighs> yeah, it's not looking good for you, girl. I feel like I'm doing like a red table talk interview. Okay, but like, who is this? I was hired by a um, agency. It was the, the NCA, the National Cheater Association. That's who sent me. All right. I didn't even get this information because i literally i see all oh my god she really admitted it too that was fucked up is this melvin yeah okay cool um why did you cheat on kenna who said i cheated on kenna uh kenna herself did actually why are you calling me who is this are you her mom <laughs> No, I'm not a mom. I'm a 23 year old male. You do not sound like you're 23 or that you're a male. I get that a lot, especially in drive through windows. Anyways, back to you. That's tough. You can cry about it. He really said, are you her mom? No, Melvin. Isn't that the name of like the zebra in fucking Madagascar? The giraffe's name is Melman. Close enough. Should I dox them? Just kidding. I won't do that. This guy says he cheated on me with a twink. Hello. Hey Mike, why did you cheat on Alex with a literal twink? Oh, excuse me? Well, that's so weird because I'm not into twinks. I'm into bears. And from the sound of your voice, it sounds like you're more than a twink. You're a stick. <laughs> yeah, I keep laughing. I don't know who, how you got this number. Um, it might have been my ex and I wanted to ruin lunch. And yes, we were having lunch when I was cheating on him. Check your voice. You don't even know who I am. I know exactly who you are though. How do you know? I have my sources. I deleted everything years ago, so I don't know how you got anything about me. Okay, well, this has been fun. Equally enlightening and also offensive. Did you cheat or no? Is this bullshit? Yes, actually. Um, this is like old news, like years, like two years ago. Hey Jackson, I just wanted to call and ask you why you cheated on your past relationship with over 15 girls and you knocked one of them up. Who is this? You don't need to know who this is. I'm asking you a very important question. Bro, who do you think you are talking like this, bro? Get the fuck out of here. I don't watch my own damn business, bro. Why are, you, why are you calling it, bro? Get out of here. You know we can track your shit, bro. No caller ID. Oh, no. Yeah, good luck with that, buddy. Some of these men, like, some of them I literally can't even talk to because it makes me so mad. Who do you think you're fucking talking to? Uh, you. <laughs> is this Jessica? It is. I was calling to ask you, why did you cheat on Preston? Hello? You heard me. Why'd you Who do is this? Why'd you do it, Jessica? Who is this? Don't worry about it. Hmm. He seemed like a good boyfriend. You sound stunned. Maybe just a tad. Yeah. So I I'm not done yet, baby Kens. Your call has been forwarded at the tone. Please record your message. You can ignore the situation all you want, Jessica, but it will always be there. Hello? Hey, is this Ben? Yes, it is. Awesome. Why did you cheat on Kaylin with your ex too? Pardon? Uh, can I ask why you're calling me the truth? I'm calling to find the truth. Okay. Um, we hadn't, there wasn't really any, um, the, that one is not true. That's not true. I can, t I can promise you that. I think it is true. It doesn't sound like you have a solid case against what I'm saying. Um, 
the statement that I had. Okay. And, and, and hey, like, Benny, Benny, we're not in court. Uh, just talk to me like a normal human. Did you or did you not cheat on Kaylin? I did not. I'm literally, I can tell you're lying. Are your palms sweating right now as I'm asking you this? No, not at all, actually. Hmm. Well, you told her she was just a friend when you and Kaylin dated. I, I, under, I understand that under circumstances, it's, it's very hard to believe. Um, the day that Kaylin and I met up, I, I, I don't remember if I was late. Um, but no, I was not with my ex at that time. We weren't even talking. Um, because of situations that happened before Kaylin and I even were talking with my ex and blah, blah, blah. Her boyfriend complaining about who he is a real piece of work. But, um, so her and I would hang out occasionally during Kaylin and I's relationship because she was having hardships with her boyfriend who once again, as a real piece of work. Um, you still seem pretty defensive of your ex-girlfriend. So you did hang out with your ex while you were in a relationship with Kaylin because she was going through hardship. Yes, yes. No, that part is completely true. Yes. Okay. So did anything happen with said ex? No, not really. Not really. We would, we would go to we would go to Quick Trip. I mean. For lunch. So you, you would go on lunch dates with the ex. Jeez. Um, no, we would, so she didn't. Let's go through what we know now. You did in fact hang out with the ex while you and Kaylin were together and you would go get lunch together, but it wasn't a lunch date. No, it was not a date at all. It would be just go on, she'd get a drink. I mean, I'd buy just cause I, I was not, I'm nice. Yeah, um, and she, real gentleman. Well, I, I don't know, it's, I have money, so I'm not too worried about I it. I didn't ask. Her ex-girlfriend would stalk us occasionally and like report things to her. And I was aware that she was doing it. So I just kind of was like, okay, this is just gonna be the way that her ex is. And I thought nothing of it. All right, well, I think we've touched all bases. Uh, um, okay. Um, I guess, I don't know. I, 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 Great. I guess it's like three months ago, so I'm not terribly worried about it. Three months is not that long ago. This is still a fresh wound, Benjamin. Oh, it, oh, it is for me too. I didn't, I mean, I could give you the whole spiel about how everything went. That's okay, I don't need that. I feel like I already know you so well now. It says, I have not been cheated on, but I just wanted to say you look like Matthew from Big Mouth. You. Hi, is this Parker? Yeah. Why did you cheat on? Uh, who is this? Don't worry about it, Parker. Is it like Peter Parker? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, this is funny. I No one's laughing, Parker. Get a life. Dude, we are making up right now, and you do not understand what's going on. Not one bit. Just mind your fucking business. I don't, like, go f yourself. Like, really. It's none of your business. Me and her are working this out. You're a fucking I did have permission from to insert myself into the situation, so I don't need your sass, Parker. Go f yourself. Me and her are working through this by ourselves. I don't you think you are because she wanted me to do this. Leave me the fuck alone. You know what? I'm gonna leave you be, Parker, because you seem just like a delightful human. I really am. Oh my god. This girl is the girl that the guy cheated on the girlfriend with. She says, in my defense, I didn't know he had a girlfriend at all. Apparently they're still together. Oh my god. Oh. Hi, is this Marcos? Yeah. Why did you cheat with Does your current girlfriend know that? I don't even know. Oh, I'm sure you do. Okay. Huh? What? Asshole. Hello? Hi, is this Gary? Uh, yeah. Awesome. Why did you cheat on Jaden? Who is this? Who, who are you? I am Jaden's guardian angel, and I'm confronting you on why you did it. <laughs> So you think I did. No, th but this is funny because you think I did and so did she, but she's wrong. Wow. Tried to talk to her last time, tried to talk some sense into her, but she doesn't believe it. Don't try and gaslight me and her. We both know you did it and I'm just calling to ask why. What the why? Fuck are you on about gaslighting? Dude, get a grip. No, you, you get a grip. You're the one calling me from a private number. Fuck off. Yeah, it's my job, oh. Gary. You always know they're guilty when they get mean with you. Some of these guys who I call and they're very calm and collected and like we'll talk about it, they could be telling the truth. But when men get mean within like 10 seconds, you're a fucking liar. This one's a parent. Okay, oh my God. 
I'm gonna throw up. Hello? Is this mm -hmm. I'm just calling to ask you why did you cheat on your wife? Who is this? I'm just calling to ask you why you cheated on your wife multiple times. Who is this? Don't worry about it. I'm asking you. Okay, great. Do I call back? No, parents kind of scare me. No, I'm doing it. I don't give a fuck. Your call has been forwarded. I wish the call went on longer, but I'm also really relieved that it didn't because I can confront people when they're like my age, like that's fine. But when I'm calling, when it's your dad, ugh. I was also scared that he was on speakerphone. I was like, oh my God, am I about to wreck a marriage? This girl said, his name is Rick. And I call. Hello. Is this Corbin? Yeah. I'm just calling on behalf of and why did you cheat on them both? No, who did he cheat on them with? This doesn't even sound like Corbin. It's not Corbin, it's his girlfriend. Oh my god. Okay, well girl, he's probably cheating on you too, just a heads up. Who is this? Uh, you don't need to know. Well, you called with no color ID. Well, yeah, this is business. You for real? What? You for real? Am I for real? Yeah. Look, if you are his girlfriend, just keep an eye out for Selena because he may not be the most loyal um, choice. Hello. Hi, is this Dean? Uh, yes. Why did you cheat on um, Mahina? And you did it after you gave her a promise ring? Not cool. <laughs> Hello. Hi, is this Yeah. Why did you cheat on Oh my God, she's still on that. Okay, get it through her thick skull that I am gay. Okay, do that for me. Wait, what? Hold on, let's rewind a bit. Actually, not a bit, let's rewind all the way. Did you guys date? Yes, you sound gay. Like, you know what I mean. Okay. Yeah. Here, here's how it is. So, we got together, and I was like, sure, this is fine, whatever. And so then I was like, I don't feel like way that I do with her than I do with the guy I had a crush on at the time. And then we went on a band trip, and I gave him up and it was like ooh fun and then i was like hey can we like break up now and she was on me and she talked to me to all her friends like oh he cheated on me though he cheated on me that was fun guys um i'm gonna go watch maybe like a rom-com maybe something that'll cheer me up because that was fucking depressing maybe i'll watch the other woman i really want to know Oh my god, everyone go to bed.